Hi there, my friends. Welcome to your daily dose at home with the Calgary Zoo. My name is Jen, and I'm a proud part of the education team here. And today, we're talking about the sounds that some frogs and toads make. My hope is that it'll help you identify some of our local species. And also, we're going to imitate some of those sounds so you can make your own wetland band. Frogs and toads, just like other amphibians, are super cool. Their permeable skin makes them sensitive to environmental changes, so they're really good indicators of the health of the area that they're in. And also, some of them can use their eyeballs to help them swallow. Very cool. Each spring, the males of frogs and toads will sing. They'll call to attract mates. Now, if you go out to your wetlands in the early morning or evening, you might hear some of them. Today, we're going to explore the sounds of three frogs and one toad. Now, two of these species you're likely to hear around Calgary, and two of them you're not, uh, because they've lost their habitat. But all four of them are going to make great members of our band. So, we'll start with the two that you're likely to hear around Calgary. First up is the boreal chorus frog. Now, this little tree frog is a little dude, maybe about four centimeters big. Um, it can be found around ponds in open forested areas. And its call is probably something you've heard. It sounds a lot like when you run your thumbnail over a, over a comb like this. So if you want to pause here and go get yourself a comb, you're going to join in this chorus with me. So first off though, we'll hear what the actual frog sounds like. It sounds just like this. That is the sound of a boreal chorus frog. Little dude, big cool sound. So grab your comb, and it's gonna sound like this. Our next sound is from a wood frog. Wood frogs are medium-sized frogs, about eight centimeters, and they like, as you might guess, woodland ponds. Now their sound is a lot like another animal you might hear. So we'll listen for the sound, and then I want you to practice it with me. Alrighty, here is the wood frog. Okay, sounded a lot like a duck, didn't it? So we're gonna practice this one together. Quack, 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 quack. What'd you think? We sound like wood frogs? This next sound is from a toad, the Canadian toad. They're a little bit smallish for toads, and they've got this super cool cranial crest or bump between their eyes. Normally they're found in the prairies and aspen parklands and all the way up to the tundra, but here in Alberta, they're losing a lot of their habitat, so they'll be pretty rare to hear. Their sound is pretty cool and it's gonna be pretty fun for us to try to imitate. So let's listen to it. All right, kinda sounds like an alarm clock. We're gonna try it here and you can try it with me. My best attempt at this is Let's hear what you've got. Our last sound for today is the northern leopard frog. You would have learned a lot about these frogs in our daily dose. And you know that the Calgary Zoo is doing a lot of work to make sure that there are more northern leopard frogs, particularly in British Columbia. These are medium-sized frogs and they're distinguished by their super cool spots. Now in Alberta, their habitat is being fragmented. So you might be really, really lucky to hear a northern leopard frog out here in Calgary. But let's, let's listen to them and see, maybe you will. Their sound is pretty cool, so this is another one that's gonna be pretty tricky. Let's give it a whirl. Let's hear what they sound like. Okay, stay with me here and try this one. Okay, first it sounds a bit like a snore. And then, uh, 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 uh. So thank you so much for playing along and trying those sounds out with me. Your job now with your take home activity is to try to make a wetland band. So take some of these sounds with your family or on your next online meeting or with your class and assign an animal to each person or each group of people. 
and try those sounds out all together. Put it all together and make the sounds of the wetlands. Thanks again for listening and thank you so much for supporting wildlife conservation.